Hey everybody, what's up? It's me, Marcus, back here in BMX Streets Pipe. And notice above my head there in the corner, it says 1.9.9. This is actually an older version of Pipe. And the reason why I'm playing this older version and a lot of other people are as well, is because it's a lot easier to mod on PC. You can do a lot more with it. It's it's not locked like the newer version is. So with the older version, we've now got the map importer so we can have an infinite number of maps and just select whichever one we want on the fly in the game. Similar to Skater XL and Descenders, actually it's the exact same thing as Skater XL and Descenders when it comes to the map importer. Also, there's the possibility that we, cats. There's the possibility that we could be getting multiplayer as well because with the older version, the files are a little bit more accessible. So in Skater XL, someone has modded multiplayer in. That might be possible with Pipe in the older version. So we'll see if that happens. But right now, I'm going to be riding this map that's made by Hubba. It's a dirt jump map. He made it pretty much to just test this map importer. And he said that he didn't spend much time placing the grass or trees. So it may look weird here and there. This map is sweet. You've probably already seen from the thumbnail, this place is really awesome, so let's check that out. So for this mod, you actually spawn into the community center, just the regular community center, and you hit M on the keyboard. And right now, I've only got one map in here, but we're gonna go to this one. You click on it, and then it'll take a little bit to load in, but once it loads in, you'll see what happens. So it loads in, and then it puts you right here on the spawn point. Sometimes it doesn't put you on the spawn point. You've actually got to crash one time, and then it'll put you up here. Weird glitches, I know. There's another glitch too, you'll see here in a second with the view, but um, there's still some bugs with it, but it's pretty cool that we have the map importer now here in Pipe. Now, if you wanna revert your game back to the old version, there is going to be a tutorial link down in the description for you guys. And then also just go to the tutorials tab in the, uh, the Pipeworks Discord and it'll have tutorials in there on how to do all this. These dirt jumps are tricky because if you take off too high up, then you'll go straight up and you'll case like that. But if you hop a little bit lower on the takeoff, you'll go too far out, you go too deep, and then you'll lose all your momentum. So it's all about finding that right line where you need to take off on the jump. I normally just pump the, the drop in, and then it gives me the speed for the first hit. Now it's the second one and the third ones that are... See, like I just went straight up on that thing. backflip off the first one it's just a nice mellow three off the second one tire grab or that was a seat grab actually i think oh i cased that gap that's over some water let's see what that looks like actually that's a cool gap that water looks good too and then it looks like i've never even made it this far so it looks like you got another jump over the water and then it turns right and then you've got some big jumps right over there too so oh my god that's a huge step up so i just want to get a clean run throughout this whole thing that'll be sweet along with this map there are already a few other ones that have been released with the map importer as well so a lot of really cool stuff coming with this i think got the first three Let's see if i can get this one double across the there it is. Oh my god, I went way too high up. <laughs> right into the water. There's also a really cool transfer you can do off this first jump. If you hit it and go off to the side here, you can actually land on the downside of that hill. <laughs> but the problem is you run right into the side of the landing of that jump on the second lane that comes back. Alright, got the seven. Oh my god, I didn't rotate it enough. Landed on the back tire. Alright, got it that time. Double backflip. Let's see if I even have the speed to get over the double here oh yeah no footed can front flip bar spin this is as farthest this is the farthest i've ever made it <laughs> oh my god i landed right on top all right 
First three down. Again. That one's fun. And not even getting this at all. Not even close. That was a lot of air for how weak that trick was. Pretty solid first three jumps right there. All right. Making it this far and going straight up. <laughs> You've got to take off at just the right place on these jumps or you're either going to go straight up or too deep. Oh man, that was clean. That was probably the best first three jumps that I've gotten so far. I know the last one was just a tuck no hander, but. That's kind of what I default to when I don't think I'm gonna make it. I just go tuck no hander, just like hopefully get that extra link. I think these are the hardest dirt jumps yet. I think they're the hardest ones we've seen in this game. Because there are so many of them and then trying to link them all together is just like impossible it feels like. <laughs> oh man, that was stupid on the second jump. First one was sweet though. I like the triple whip. That was clean. Here comes this stupid thing. And what do you know? I didn't go far enough. And it's not even a speed issue. It's just I'm taking off too far up and I know what I'm doing wrong. I just keep doing the same thing over and over. Huge tuck no hander to tell whip. Alright, I'll take it. I'll take it. I'm this far. So I need to take off lower on the jump. And I, I I swear I took off lower. Still went the same distance though. Maybe I need to take off higher. I don't know. I don't have that same issue with these other ones like I have with that one. Well, I, I guess I do from time to time. I will come up short every now and then. The first three were clean though. know what to do on that one and the thing is I've like I've made it a couple times but only with front flips I put a session marker right here to just try and get over this thing try and figure it out because I don't know what I'm doing on it oh I took off a little bit further down and I made it same thing on that one all right so this is the furthest I've made it it looks like you go uphill right here and oh, then you got like a little step down Oh, this is sweet. Cased it. And then a big step up right there. Alright, I think I'm ready. I think I'm ready to just try and do everything all in one line. Maybe. If I don't blow it on this part when I try and come through here. Alright, let's try it from the top. Let's see if I can get this thing. Feel like, feel like I kind of know what I'm doing now. Maybe, maybe not. Probably not. Definitely not. <laughs> okay, I got the first three. Really clean. And I threw a 360 in there too, which makes it a little bit more difficult. Oh, I got the second one. And I landed on my back tire. I didn't rotate it enough. Okay, just a nice simple tail whip. <laughs> nice simple tire grab. One hand to turn down. Just keeping it really easy right here. And still didn't go far enough. Oh, 
Oh my god, I did not think I was gonna get that. Am I gonna make it this time? I cased it, but I count it. I know I'm doing a lot of tail whips here, but I'm just I'm just trying to keep it simple because this is the furthest I've gotten. Super simple, I cased, but I just want to make it through here. That's all I care about at this point. I can sit and do like the most ridiculous tricks ever and then just make an edit out of it. Dude, that thing rides like a quarter pipe. What? You, you have to find the sweet spot on the takeoff with all these jumps and it's so difficult to do. That was a nice first three again. All right, made that guy. Over jumped that one, but let's make. And did not make that one. Same deal. Trying to find that sweet spot, dude. I cannot find it on every single one of these jumps all the way through. Okay, first three down. Got that one. Got that one. Ooh, that was clean. This is the cleanest one so far. Now this right here. Oh, I got it. I can't see what, what's going on in here. The trees, man. All right, the first thing was sweet again. I can get I can get some good lines there. It's just right through here where I can't seem to figure figure it out. And I screwed up there. Wrote it like a spine. You know what? I'm about to just I'm about to chalk it up as to I can't do it <laughs> because my god these things are tough nice and easy this is it this is my last try if I don't get it this time I'm just gonna say that I can't get it I'm giving myself a chance though it looks like for the most part, I'm gonna come up short here. But I'm still on two wheels, so definitely giving myself a chance with this one. And blowing it. My god. And I got the last row. Even though it wasn't all in one line, I'll take it. I swear, dude, trying to get the sweet spot of every single one of those is almost impossible. It's almost an hour and 20 minutes of recording. And uh, I couldn't get all three lines in, in succession. I just couldn't do it. So I'm going to wrap this video up now. I did not hit all three lanes in one run. But I got like two and a half. So I'll take that. Let me see if I can get this last lane right here. I highly, highly doubt it. Yeah, definitely an over jump. <laughs> oh, I'm still going technically. Oh, well. That's going to be it. Thank you guys for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, hit the like button. Subscribe for more content. If, uh, if you're wondering how hard these jumps are, download them and try and play them because they are nearly impossible. Other than that, I'm out of here and you guys have 
a good rest of your day.